In this video, I will show how I build a lid for a vivarium. I start with cutting strips to make the frame for the lid. The strips were not long enough, so I elongated them, using bow tie like joints. A groove was routed in all the strips lengthwise at a slight angle. The strips were then glued together to form the bottom frame. Sheets of 4mm plywood were cut to make the sides of the lid. The lid has sloping sides and angles were cut appropriately. Some of the sides needed to be elongated a bit. Holes were cut for the ventilation fans. Angled braces were glued into the corners and the sides were glued to the bottom frame. After the glue had dried, the lid was flipped upside down and the long sides for the top frame was glued in place. Of the frame was finished by gluing in the short pieces. The top of the lid was glued in place on the inside of the top frame. Spaces for the hinges were carved into the lid as well as the top of the vivarium. The lid is secured to the vivarium with three hinges. The lid was stained on the outside and the inside. This was followed by three coats of clear lacquer. Foam seals were placed into the groove at the bottom of the lid to ensure that the moisture and temperature remains constant. Finally, the extraction fans were installed on the inside. During installation, the lid was placed on the vivarium after the lights fixture was installed. Having a closed lid on a vivarium ensures that the moisture and temperature remains constant. This lid is also big enough to house the lighting fixture as well as the extraction fans. Thanks for watching.